On free commerce, you have the ability to connect your custom trading view indicators and your custom trading view alerts to free commerce so that whenever an alert is triggered on trading view, it will create a new deal on your free commerce account or you can also close deals. So the way to do this is that you typically set up a free commerce DCA bot just like you normally do. In the deal starting condition, you need to choose trading view custom signal. Now after you've chosen trading view custom signal, you can create the bot and save it. And then you will see this overview page of the bot, which you can also, if you already have a bot running, you can also navigate via DCA bot and then just click on the view right here. After that, you can then scroll down and you will see that all these commands are available for the trading view custom signals. And so we can start a deal, for example, and now this bot is only trading Bitcoin, so it will always open a new Bitcoin deal. If you're using a multi-pair bot, then you need to also add the pair to the message, which will then look like this. So everything remains the same. It's just that you make another line where you enter the pair, which the bot has to start a new deal for. Now, the most common use case is to just have a custom trading view indicator that will start and stop deals. So whenever an alert on your trading view account is triggered, it needs to send this message to free commerce. Now, the way we do this is via a webhook URL. This is only possible if you have at least a pro plan on TradingView. So you can see that they have two plans available. Either you buy monthly, which would be $14.95, or you can also purchase it annually, and then it would go down to $12.95 per month. I also have a referral link in the description. If you use it, and if you buy a monthly plan, you get $10 for free, and with an annual plan, you get $30 for free. After you've upgraded your account to the pro plan, you can then go ahead and set up an alert. For, so for example, what we could do just to demonstrate is I can create an alert right here. And then you need to specify webhook URL, and then you can specify the webhook URL of free commerce. Now this can be found if you just Google um, trading your custom signals free commerce, and then you can find it under enable webhooks. I will also put it in the description so you can copy it. After that, you need to get then go over to your bot. You can click on this message to copy the message and then just copy paste the message into the message body. You could also give it an alert, alert name. So for example, if you're having a multi-pair bot and you have these alerts on different pairs, then you can always specify the pair in the alert name. So you always know which one that recently triggered. Now we can create this deal. Now we can see that the alert immediately triggered. We can see it in the alert log. So it just triggered right now. And now if I go back to the bot and I refresh the page, I can see that right now, same time 1018 that the bot has now started a new deal with the bitcoin pair and now if we go over to my deals i can also see that the bot currently started this deal now to close the deal it's exactly the same way we go back to our dca bot scroll down copy the other message and then we can create an alert just copy paste the other message create it and then we can wait until the deed is closed. I'll just put it right here so it closes immediately. Now we can see that it triggered immediately. This means that again, if we refresh the page, we can see that the bot actually closed at the market price. And if we go back to the history, we can see that this deal was just recently closed. What you can also do is connect your custom trading view indicators and your custom trading view strategies to your free commerce. DCA bot. Most of the time, it doesn't really make sense to manually create all these alerts. For example, I have an indicator down here, which you can see in the white color. This is the drawdown from the all time high. So right now, we can see Bitcoin is down 31% from the, the all time high. So, what I can do is go ahead and click into my indicator. I can set up an alert for the drawdown all time high. And if I enter negative 50 and I close the deal at negative 50, then this alert will be triggered as soon as Bitcoin is down 50% from its all time high. And then I can also set up another alert where I can say I want it to be 50% above the all time high. This will be my close deal. And so in this way, Bitcoin will always be bought at minus 50% of the all time high. And that would always close at 50% over the all time high.